United States-backed Syrian Kurdish groups announced Thursday June polls will be postponed until August. The move comes amid warnings from Turkey that the elections pose a national security threat. Analysts say the election for mayors in northeastern Syria, under the control of the Syrian Democratic Forces, or SDF, is crucial for the Kurdish group. They say the SDF seeks to consolidate and broaden its support in the wider community through what it calls its social pact, which includes a commitment to elections. They um, wanted to organize an uh, election, but each time it was postponed because of the war, because of the security reason, and now because they have done this um, new social uh, pact, social agreement uh, with the population, they want to stabilize the, the administration and they want to um, organize this uh, election to get more legitimacy. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan says he will not allow the creation of what he describes as a terror state on Turkey's border. Ankara accuses the SDF of having links to the Kurdish insurgents fighting Turkish forces for decades. Analysts say Ankara sees the polls as a threat to both Turkey and Syria's territorial integrity. It's a clear challenge to the integrity, unity of Syria. Once any party in Syria with an armed group starts doing elections, well, it's a challenge, especially for the future of Syria, because they will claim autonomy first, then maybe a federation, then a confederation, then independence. So there's no end. For months, Ankara has been threatening to launch an attack against the SDF. The US military, however, is working with the Kurdish group in battling Islamic State. This support by Washington has outraged Ankara. Analysts warn elections threaten to further damage US-Turkish relations. There are a number of issues in the bilateral relationship, and chief among these is US support for Syrian Kurds. I think from a U.S. perspective, elections just make it a tidbit harder to manage relations with Turkey. And they worry that SDF holding elections could trigger a, 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 a sort of a dramatic response from Turkey, perhaps an incursion. Washington said the situation is not conducive to fair elections and called for them to be postponed. Turkish forces, meanwhile, have been bombarding the Syrian Kurdish controlled region along with targeting leading figures. Analysts warn the attacks will increase until the polls are cancelled. Land-to-land uh, bombings with hobbits from the Turkish side of the border to the uh, civilian infrastructure uh, and also to, to, to some targets of choice with armed drones. Perhaps we can see an increase uh, in these operations. Ankara will likely step up its military pressure on the SDF but at the same time is looking to Washington to use its influence to get the polls cancelled. Doreen Jones, VOA News, Istanbul.